this is always fun. I'm setting up my solar panels. See where I've got one spot for the cable and I'm running this stainless um, bar going across. And uh, man, I spent all morning hooking this one up and I lost it. The diver's coming over to clean the boat, so um, Monday, because I'm doing haul out on Thursday. So I'll see if he can dive down there. I don't want that crap sitting in the mud. Um, otherwise, I mean, it's only about 15 feet, maybe 12 feet right now. And um, I'm thinking that it's, uh, I'm thinking that it's, uh, Shit, man, it, it could be 100 feet from here already and rolling down the down the bay. That sucks, man. That really sucks. Um, they're kind of old panels, um, so I may go with some longer ones that are narrower for the sides here. And they're definitely lighter nowadays, too. So um, it's just a matter of doing things right, I guess. Okay, I'll uh, keep you guys posted with that situation. Test one, two. What do I have to talk about today? It's been a while. I, uh, I've been busy with the boat. I was trying to get out of here on April 1st. You guys saw my uh, Saznak interview and all that. Um, I was almost there and then the mooring company said, hey, we need your, uh, we need your uh, Coast Guard info. And I said, okay. So I sent them my paperwork and they're like, hey, this is expired. And I said, yeah, let me send you my other one which I never got. And then I realized that the Coast Guard back sometime had spelled Zephyr with an F. And I've already got all the decals on my boat. I've got everything handled where Zephyr's spelled with a P. Now, according to the Coast Guard registration, mine's the only boat spelled with an F. Um, which, I mean, that's cool and all, but and I could change it, but uh, I'm also California registered and it's spelled with a P. The wind turbine's causing the camera to shake. Um, eh. Anyways, uh, the boat's a wreck. Throwing on a new prop. Indeed. Uh, He hasn't fallen off the boat yet. He's only fallen off the docks like twice. <laughs> uh, I've never seen a pug uh, push a 10,000 pound uh, racing trimaran across the water, but he sure did it when he was trying to climb onto it and that put him in the water, man. So I wish I'd have got that, lost my Taco Bell. We're here pressure washing the boat now, getting, uh, getting everything off the bottom. It's loud. It's really loud. But uh, I told them I'm going in for paint and they were like, oh, okay, sure. Like now they're not worried about uh, going through anything. So that's cool. I just hope they don't go through the fiberglass. Nah, it's not going to happen. solar panels on it. Nice. After a fun nerve-wracking time I uh, got Zephyr down into the <laughs> down into the slip here 
Um, this crane, it's going to lift the boat out. As usual, you guys know the drill. You've watched 50 silent for 7,000 videos so on this, but um, yeah, made it. Here for paint, so pretty stoked. I'll uh, keep you guys posted. I wish that uh, I wish that I could uh, show you getting hauled out, but we got here kind of late because it was raining like hell all the way up until just a couple hours ago, and uh, the weather broke. Uh, and that's it, man. So we'll see how it goes, and uh, we'll come back in a day or two and check out the paint. All right. like a cockroach in a cherry bowl. That's the bad one right there. There's my new prop. Nice. Super stoked about that. paint left on this baby at all. I don't see any blisters though. That is. It's like old glass work or something. Down there, right there. That one's clean. They polished that. Wow. So I picked up this old Miata. It's a 2001. All right, so this is a this is a, a 2001 uh, SE. I'll show you a couple things with it here. I'm um, starting with the special edition badge here on the side. Um, this car is British Racing Green. Only the special editions were, and uh, comes with these plush leather seats. Yes. Look at those babies. Yeah, the factory, uh, they didn't hold out when it came to that. Vinyl top, check this out. I've been doing a lot of work on this. Got a little tape job here, been working on that. You know, it's kind of coming out here. I noticed it's a zipper uh, zipper rear window, which is kind of a trip. I've, I've never really seen one on a mirror. I know some of them have them, some of them don't. Wood Nardi shifter, Nardi steering wheel. If you don't know who Nardi was, uh, he was an old Italian racer cat that uh, used to do things. Pretty cool, had to look him up, I'm not pretending like I know everything. Hood's cherry, completely, shit'll buff out. No front plate, but I just found the bracket and the front plate. So I've been cleaning this thing out and I think I've got, now uh, there's still some change in there, but this is what was in the bottom. And just whatever. There's a front plate bracket. Did come with a German battery. Check this out here. That's the wear bar on the spare. It's 
dude was running the spare for how many miles? That, there's got to be a thousand miles on that spare. And yeah, more trunk stuff. Wheels need some work. You can see the clear coats coming off. That's just a cool year project, I think. You know, just to poke around. Um, but she runs good, man. High compression engine, race suspension, four or uh, six speed transmission. Anyways, uh, thought I'd show you guys this. Uh, oh, wait, one more thing. Yeah, look at that. That's a treasure. Look at that. All right. Okay, bye guys. I just wanted to kind of give you a walkthrough. Um, yeah. There she is. Jewel in the rough, man. All right. I'm going to keep going on her. It's getting dark. and uh, But hey, 1200 bucks. You can't beat it, right? Yeah, more money. Even more money. Yuck. this with your fingernails no this is a big fat Let's see what this is so say it's two euros oh my gosh yeah That's a few bucks look at that that's a half a quart of oil huh You can flip it upside down, and it's it's videoing upside down. You know, you have to flip it this way. If this is this way or this way, you know, the whole thing's going this way. They got another one coming out right here. This looks good. That's cool. Pretty happy about it. <laughs> 